Hello, I'm Alana. I like to dance. I like to do gymnastics. Alana's always been this um, this wee dynamo. She loves being around people, full of energy. I really love karate. Hiya! Growing up, Alana did have uh, eczema. Lots of people have it. You treat it and you just go on living your life quite happily. But in 2014, Alana's eczema took a dramatic turn for the worse. She woke up one day, pretty much her whole body was red. Some parts of her skin looked like they'd been scalded with boiling water. It's a lot more serious than people might think it is. But it was, it was, it was eczema. Alana's eczema was so severe, she was admitted to hospital. I was just, like, really itchy and I couldn't stop. It felt like there wasn't any skin on my arm. It's horrible. People should never experience that in their life, that their child's in so much discomfort that they're pleading with you to, to stop the pain. She became quite self-conscious. It's not just the skin that's affected, it's her self-esteem, her self-image. My eczema did make me cry. I just wanted to have skin like other people. It really is heartbreaking. You want to take that pain away from them, but you just you just can't. With Alana's skin condition being so extreme, her family were introduced to Eczema Outreach Scotland, a children in need supported charity who help families living with eczema. It's quite hard to understate the importance of Eczema Outreach Scotland and the impact they've had on our family. Engaging with other parents to understand their fears and their worries. So today you're going to have a think about how our ex mom makes us feel. I'm job. going to draw a hedgehog. A jaggy hedgehog? Yeah. I'm not the only one that has eczema. There's other children that have it as well. It's not only me. It just made me feel happy and excited. She's got her confidence back. She done a talk at school about eczema. I got a certificate for, for standing up and telling people about my eczema and telling them that um, it's not catchable if I just touch you. It was great. It's like seeing Alana as we know Alana to be. At the moment, Alana's eczema is under control. She'll still have the occasional flare-up. The difference now is we know what to do. I can pick up the phone, I can contact someone who can provide that support. If we hadn't become part of Exum Outreach Scotland, I really don't know. I really don't know where I would be.